Hello guys, Lego Show TV here, and we're back again for another Lego Ninjago Season 14 The Island Set Review. Set 71746, Jungle Dragon, 506 pieces, ages 8 plus. We have Island Lloyd, Island Zane, a Thunder Keeper, I'm sorry if I butcher this name, Polaric. Is that how you say it? Tell me in the comment section below. You can guess it comes with a storm amulet. Here you can see the front of the box. Here you can see the back of the box with the features of the set. Now let's take a look at the set once it's built. All right, so here's everything we get in the Jungle Dragon. And we're gonna start off with taking a look at the set itself. Here are the following features for this part of the set. One, you can put Zane on it. Number two, it has two stud shooters. Number three, it has a cool printed piece. Also, Zane looks very cool on this raft. Starting off here at the head of the Jungle Dragon, or in the show, he is referred to as Zippy by Jay. You can see the nice print on the face. That is one giant mold that makes up the upper part of the face and a sticker there. See, there are some horns in white here. There's a really nice use of a fang piece as the tongue. And I really like the bottom mold too. Flip that piece to either side. See, for some reason, one part of the leg has a chain on it. And there's these nice Minecraft ingots in gunmetal gray, which would make nice netherite ingots in the future. Lego take note. Just very nice detailing, adding them into all four of the legs there. There is kind of an issue for me. You see, it's mainly with the wings. Can't move the wings very much. It's annoying. There's never been a color scheme that I've liked that goes so well together other than turquoise and gold. This design is different for Ninjago Dragons. The last features here is that you can move this tail back and forth. It doesn't go up and down. It just goes from side to side. The detailing on it is nice. You get these shield pieces in turquoise blue and these pizza pieces in turquoise blue. And like I said, the color scheme has never worked this well. Turquoise and gold look really good together. You can put Lloyd in this little seating part here. And there's some nice sticker detail there and right there. All right, so on to the minifigures here. We have Island Zane and Island Lloyd. Both have been seen in sets before. Zane comes in this set and the Catamaran Sea Battle. Lloyd comes in this set and the Lloyd's Chopper Bike. There you can see what they look like from the front with all their gear on. And they have very nice torso detailing and leg detailing there. Here's a cool trick guys. If you want to see the face prints a lot better, then flip the masks to the side that you would normally not put the head on. And it looks really, really cool. And it looks like how they pulled their masks down in the show. Both Ninja have really cool face prints. I like Lloyd's a lot. I'm going to use this in stop motions from now on because it looks really cool. So you should remove the gear too. See the back torso detailing for both of them and then Lloyd's calm face. Here's a good look at the storm amulet if you missed it. All right, the final two minifigures here are Polaric, and I'm sorry if I butchered the name, and a Thunderkeeper. Both of them have the same torso and leg prints there, and one of them just has a mask on, and Polaric has two faces, so you can see both of them there. The printing on the tiki mask is pretty cool. If you remove the mask, you can see that the Thunder Keeper's face is just the same one as Polaric's bottom face there. You can see both have tiny bits of back head printing and you can see the back torso detailing there. Alright, I really have enjoyed this set. 
and I hope you guys have enjoyed this review. And my rating is going to be a 9. The reason for that is because of the wings. Now I mentioned this earlier that the way they attach the wings I wasn't a fan of. And I just don't think that it's a good way to attach wings for a dragon in the future. They use a ball joint, which is great. They use one of those mixed ball joints and sockets, which is fine. But what I'm talking about here is they attach them and they go straight up. And you can't move wings in the position like that. It just doesn't do good. So what you gotta do, it's pretty basic, is you take the wings out and you put them in another way where they're not sticking straight up. And that's how you fix it. And other than that, I have no issues with the set. The build is great. The side build is one of Zane's best side builds in a while, and the minifigures are good. So, other than the wings, I am fine with the set. That's going to give it a 9 though. The wings will. So, if you did enjoy this video, please comment, like, and subscribe. My last island set review for Season 14 will be the Catamaran Sea Battle. So if you did enjoy this video, please comment, like, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.